Here's a quick view of the boat. Got a light up here in the mast, just a white one. Got my green and my red navigation lights. Oop, don't break it now. I actually have a smoke maker hooked up to this that does blow out smoke pretty, pretty good. Got a solder on a wire I broke off. That's alright. Got some of the details here on the back. Lifeboats. They're actually just loose on there. I hang on the rope. Don't really sway. I treated it with super glue, but I had to handwrite the name on there, so that was a bit of a pain. I know in real life it's actually shorter, but trying to keep it neat. So I do have some screws there to fasten it down along the gasket I made out of hot glue if I feel the need be, but really doesn't need it. Antenna comes up through the deck and kind of hidden in the crane there. The handrails along the decking here. I hand soldered. And then all the ones up top here are just twine. I found it a lot easier to use the twine and the split pins. So. Turned out great. Looks nice. Not bad for a scratch built model. Got an anchor on the other side there. Portholes are just painted on. Inside the cabin I do have a light, so the whole cabin lights up all the windows. There's another light up here on the front mast. Can't complain for my first scratch built model. Well, model boat this size anyway. Back section, the cabin lifts off. I have a connector for the lights if I feel I need to remove it. Another connector there for the hose to go in for the smoke machine. Down here is the smoke machine sitting here. So, got to re-solder on this wire. Back onto there. I broke it off. It's my fill tube with a plug in it. This tube just hooks into the bottom side. My servo in there. My bulkhead. motor that's just pressure fits in here actually a really tight fit what I did was I taped up the sides of this and folded it under the bottom and I actually covered it in Vaseline and then I came in here with my hot glue ran a thick bead down each end and I pressed it into it so I made a little gasket seal there and then I took the hot glue filled in the sides I created a side gasket. So once I put it on there, it's a continuous gasket all the way around. The whole outside of the boat is completely sealed. All the way down both sides. All along the front, you can see there where I sealed and repainted it. 
but for the guts, it's my main battery. It's nickel cadmium, an old battery I had. It's for the starter for my RC nitro truck. Here I just went to surplus, in our electrical section. Got a four AA battery holder. Got my little connector on there. Just added it on, shrink wrapped everything up to the wires. This originally just came with the wires sticking out, had no connector. To me, a connector that connects to my ESC. My ESC, I can actually change these prongs around here and I can change it to have reverse or I could have just brake or I could have forward brake and reverse. And I can also change the other one for nickel metal halide hydride or nickel cadmium or I can switch it over for lipo. But then I need a new charger. So, nickel metal hydride. To me a connector. This just runs my smoke generator. So I could have hooked it all up on one big battery, but I needed a lot of ballast anyway. I ended up putting 25 pounds of ballast in this thing. It's 5 feet long, 6 inches wide. I have an on-off switch here for my lights. There's my receiver. It's a 4 channel receiver, so I still have 2 channels. I'm going to add a horn. And then I have a continuous on or off button for the other one. But the horn I'm going to put on the one that's button activated on my remote. Smoke machine on off, ESC on off. Nice little model boat. Had it out for the maiden voyage. It sailed nice. And the only bit of water this tiny bit back here don't know where it came in from more than likely I need to put a little more grease in there but it worked my bulkhead kept the water on the side it's supposed to be In the back here, I just use a piece of, it's actually camo duct tape, but it's dark, so it hides up the hole there. It's just a connector from the servo to the rudder. So. <clears throat> I do have a stuffing tube on my rudder as well. There's my prop. So I'll show you how it went on the water.